First at five, we want to begin with some breaking news in a murder case we've been tracking since the beginning. After a month-long trial and just five hours of deliberations, a jury has found Leron Porter guilty of shooting and killing 17-year-old Tiffany Tallow in May 2011. Let's get right to Iowa News reporter Susan Campbell live in the newsroom with those breaking details. Susan. Steve, prosecutors say the victim's family is satisfied with the verdict, but we've learned the defense has already decided to appeal the, conv the conviction. Friday afternoon, a lengthy murder trial came to an end, and Leron Porter was convicted of second-degree murder. Prosecutors were trying for a first-degree murder conviction. The fact of the matter is he was still found guilty. It's up to a life sentence. The jury did its job. We respect that, and we're pleased with the results. He's going to jail for a long time, and rightfully so. Prosecutors say Porter shot and killed 17-year-old Tiffany Tallow in May of 2011 after a feud between two families erupted on Federal Hill. Really, it was over two girls having a relationship with one guy, and it just escalated to something that it should never have happened. It's, it's really a tragic event that happened that ended one girl's lives, and uh, multiple people ended up in jail because of this. Porter's attorney says he and his client are disappointed by the verdict. He's upset. I mean, he's devastated. Um, a second murder, a second degree murder conviction is obviously serious. Um, he's always maintained his innocence and he continues to maintain his innocence. And so when the verdict came down today, he uh, obviously was upset. At the time of the murder, Leron Porter was out on parole on a federal firearms conviction. So far, a date for sentencing has not been set. Again, the defense is planning to file an appeal coming up new at 6. We'll tell you why. Live in the newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.